So if you're in your car, if you're driving in traffic, anywhere you are, um, it's going to be an interesting one today. Today we are discussing the future of work in renewable energy. And um, this should interest you if you are an undergraduate, if you are an enthusiast in this sector. Uh, this conversation is for you today. The future of work in renewable energy. What, what is happening in this sector with jobs? We highlight this every week, but today we want to go deeper. And, and I have my guest here from um, Energy Talent Company. But uh, before that, before that, um, um, let me give you a background uh, so you, you understand what we are trying to talk about. In the first quarter of 2021, a report published by the National Bureau of Statistics um, on its website noted that Nigeria unemployment rate has risen from 2.7. 27.1 percent um, in the second quarter of 2020 to 33 percent the report further shows uh, that more than 60 percent of nigeria's working age population is younger than 24. interesting uh, unemployment unemployment for people aged between 15 to 24 stood at 53.4 percent uh, in the fourth quarter and at 37.2 percent for people aged 25 to 34. Don't worry about it. I mean, these are a lot of numbers. We'll make sense of it, you know, but I just tried to give you background of what, I mean, number of people we need to employ in the sector. Uh, but now, another interesting part is uh, there's, there's also high rates of immigration amongst youths in Nigeria due to low access to economic opportunities. What these numbers and all of this means uh, to the Nigerian economy should worry you uh, if you're a Nigerian, if you live in Nigeria, anywhere in Nigeria. But today will make sense. My guests are here. Uh, just one more before we move forward. So you know, according to Business Insider, renewable energy industry is seen a spike in popularity globally uh, with plenty of lucrative roles expected to be in demand by 2026. It means there are jobs in this sector. And we are talking about those jobs. Uh, how can you align with them? How can you fit in? How can you move into this sector uh, and start the work you need to do? Okay. All right. My guests are here. Um, very interesting people. Uh, their names. Uh, Oluwa Dari Akinwale. He's a senior curriculum and programs associate at Energy Talent Company. And uh, my very good friend, Nkechi Nwa Konobi, uh, commission, uh, communications associate from Energy Talent Company. Welcome to the show. Sorry, your mics are, are not turned off. Are not on, on rather. All right. You need to... S yes, yes. All right, we can hear you now. Can you hear me? Yes. yes. Uh, super, super. All right, welcome to the conversations. Uh, like I mentioned, we, we this thing of jobs... Uh, and today we are discussing the future uh, of work in renewable energy. You guys are going to help us, you know, to make sense out of this and tell us how you guys are working um, uh, at Energy Talent Company to, to help Nigerians, young Nigerians. I know a lot, but I'll let you do the talking today and share as much as you can. But first, uh, let me start with you, Luwa Dari. Uh, Luwa Dari Akinwale is a senior curriculums and programs associate. But tell us a little bit about your book, background and professional journey. Uh, it's an interesting one, but I want to allow you to, to go from, from, be, from a background in agri, you've gone into training and learning. Wow, amazing. Tell us about that. Uh, okay, thank you. Thank you, Wisdom. Um, I, I wouldn't say interesting quite like you've put it, but mm. uh, you're right. I started with um, a degree in uh, agriculture from the University of Agriculture at Belkuta, and um, I started my full career in Zenith Bank as a learning and development administrator. I worked also, after a while I focused there and uh, specialized particularly in e-learning. And um, afterwards I moved to insurance and worked with retail training. Okay. So, um, so uh, training is something that has been actually very uh, part of me, something I've particularly enjoyed. And mm. even though I was in the, I'm in the HR space, uh, at some point, I decided to focus particularly on that. Mm -hmm. So, and um, that, along my journey, I found my way to energy talent. And uh. um, I'm doing a lot of work in curriculum development and 
Um, so most all the training programs that we do, uh, the curriculum development, the planning design part mm. of it, that comes to me. Mm. And um, I'm also responsible for a couple of programs as we'll be discussing. Beautiful. Today. Beautiful. Ah, Igechi, <laughs> from law to communications, right. what's happening? Uh, tell us what, what's happening there and, and how did you find yourself here in Energy like Talent Company? Uh, okay, thank you, Wisdom, my very good friend. <laughs> uh, so for me, really, my career journey so far has been one of self-discovery, like mm. I like to put it. So I have a background in law, like you've rightly mentioned. Mm -hmm. I finished from the Nigerian Law School as well. But when I was posted to my National Youth Service Corps um, station, I was pretty much working in the communications department of where I was posted to. So mm. I discovered that I had, you know, a strong affinity for comms. Okay. And then I just went and got a master's degree in communication. Mm. So that really, you know, enforced my career transition Beautiful. to the field of communications and public relations. Mm. So I've worked in some companies as, you know, marketing communications officer marketing communications manager mm. i've done a bit of work in public relations okay. in brand management so right now i'm with energy talent company mm. the company that is pioneering the renewable energy transition through mm. its talents you know working as the communications uh, lead for the company and i'm enjoying it so far so it's been a lovely transition for me from yeah. law to communications yes. so, so so that means you're the best person to answer my next question um, <laughs> the name energy talent company right uh, um, gives us an idea of, of what you do but let me allow you to give us in detail uh, what do you really do as a company Okay, so I'll just put it succinctly like this. What we do as a company, we offer trainings okay. to different people, young individuals or people who are looking to start a career in renewable energy, people who are looking to career transition, you know, like, mm -hmm. a, like a transition from law to mm -hmm. communication. People who are looking to transition from other backgrounds to, to renewable, renewable energy. energy. We offer okay. trainings to them because, you know, like I went on to get a master's mm -hmm. in communications. You can't leave one field to another field without having a foundation or a background in okay. that particular field you want to get into. That's so true. Energy Talent Company pretty much offers trainings to people mm. who are interested in getting into the renewable energy space. We train these people and we you know, provide a community for them to grow mm. and we match them with companies who are interested in getting their services or the services of these are talents. Yes, mm. that's what we do mm. as a company. Beautiful. If you're just tuning in, uh, this is Power Solutions. Uh, uh, my name is Wisdom Chap Jumbo. Power Solutions is powered by All On, Energy Impact Investment Company, uh, and with support from Nigeria Info, your number one talk station. And uh, we have we are discussing today the, the future of work in renewable energy. Uh, so if you're an undergraduate, if you're a graduate, just finish your NYC, and you're just thinking, what what what's my future? What do I need to do next? Renewable energy is one sector you should go into. Uh, the, the jobs in this sector, you know, uh, I mean, in the next two, three years will be very interesting. And there are many, many, many angles you can go into this. Uh, and that's why my, my guests here today, they are trying to help us to direct and, and make sense out of this journey. Hello, Adari. Yeah. Now, my, my next question to you is, uh, ASU is on strike uh, at the moment, uh, and which means uh, students cannot graduate if you're in school you can't graduate as is on strike but at the same time uh, the ones who have graduated are struggling to get jobs and you read you, you had the statistics i read out before um uh, of unemployment in the country it's a big problem uh etc that's energy talent company how what solutions are you providing uh, you want to talk us through the solutions you have to solve this problem for nigerians yeah thank you so uh ETC is actually providing solutions for this. This is one of the things that we're doing. So um, the job we're doing in the renewable energy sector, particularly solar, is providing training and providing um, upskilling for people to either start a career okay. or even to transition. So we have, we have um, uh, programs for people who just left universities. So mm -hmm. maybe you have someone who is at home who is wondering, okay, I can't get a job. He's looking for jobs all around. I would say come along to ETC, mm. apply for our program on our uh, on our website, mm. and that program is designed in such a way to give you the skill set you require to start out a career in the solar energy industry. So um, by the time you go through the different facets of our program, we even put you on apprenticeship as part of the training with the company, so you get to 
get you get to work your you get your hands working mm. as, as part of the training and by the time you're done with that you'll be qualified you'll be prepared to handle uh, to take up a career in mm. the solar energy industry in Nigeria and of course make make a make a good income for yourself mm. so the i will call the i'll call the energy the solar energy industry one of those high value industries mm. where yeah. if you learn that skill you are equipped for life mm -hmm. there are certain skills that if you learn and you're able to do you can work anywhere you can determine the the time and the kind of jobs you want to do mm. and that's that's a core focus for us at energy talent company mm. so if you get into the programs we offer uh you will be able to enter into that uh, space and you would be able to enjoy not just the income but the independence that comes with it mm. because you design curriculum um and you're in charge of curriculum at etc uh it, it's important that i ask you this question i don't know uh, but first I, I, I understand that it, as of today, there are like 21 fast-growing jobs in the renewable energy sector. Mm -hmm. And one job um, that is at the top of all of this is solar installation. Yes. yes. You know, but now uh, I don't have experience uh, uh, in, in any of this. Someone listening now doesn't have an experience, you know. And five years ago, and I like to say this, five years ago, nobody knew roles like solar engineer solar installer yes will be a thing mm -hmm. in fact i like to say nobody knew communications <laughs> will be a role in, in renewable energy sector I, I do this today but and I, I like to make fun in that area but now my question to you how can young people you know align themselves to opportunities in this sector uh, as it is now and how do you tailor your your curriculums at etc to f to suit someone who is from an experience of zero to you know building a career in solar engineering okay all right thank you thank you wisdom so what i'll say first is uh if you're listening to this broadcast right now i would say and you're interested in um getting into this industry i'll say you've taken the very first step by listening to this broadcast because what you're doing is getting information the right information that you need mm -hmm. and uh it would also interest you to know that uh we've we've had a, a section of this program in the past and um, many of the people who applied to our program applied based on what they heard from here mm. so beautiful I'll, I'll tell you that Check what, for that <laughs> <laughs> so uh and yes thanks to all on for for, for you know championing this this is very good because one of the things it has done is that it has put this as a you know top of mind awareness for many people yeah. and they, they they see it as an option a career option so yes if you're listening to this yes you've taken the right step and i would say get get more information find out online find out in different places if you know people in the industry talk to them about what areas you fit into like wisdom said there's a number of career roles here so um the the technical ones are quite known if you're a solar installer maybe you're a design a design a solar designer you're mm. a project uh manager uh maybe you're, in, you're even even software software monitoring and so on there are a number of areas within the industry that you can fit into so um so because i know someone would say that oh i don't um i'm not an engineer mm. i didn't read engineering mm. I, I couldn't have read engineering. Mm. Let me put it that I way. Agree. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I never would have tried it myself. <laughs> but but I found I found out that mm. um, my I, I was when I came into this place, I didn't have a difficulty relating to the work mm. here. I didn't have a difficulty doing that because I was sitting in my own space of training and education, and I was able to adapt my own training, my own specialty mm. to the work here. So. Uh, and I can also tell you from my experience here that there's a lot of opportunity. So if you come in here, yes, you would, uh, I, as I said, find out opportunities. You will get to know a lot of what you can do, where you can fit in. And most importantly, since we're here, I will tell you, you can, uh, you can get on our website. You can check our social media channels mm. and see the things that we posted there. They will give you an Beautiful. idea. And you can also apply yeah. to our program. Yeah, they should stay tuned. It, it will come last. But I, I want to go to you now, um, um, Inkichi. Uh, I, I like how 
uh, uh, Darren dropped off on that. Right. But I want to ask you now, someone listening mm -hmm. um, um, has a clean energy or renewable energy company. Right. But the challenge is um, hiring the best talent or the best professionals for the job. Right. Now, how do I identify the best person to, to hire for a role in my company? I have a renewable energy company now. Um, I know this is a service ETC offers. Yes. But uh, speak to, to this uh, 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 person now who, who is listening. But how do I hire the best talent? Okay, you want to hire the best talent mm -hmm. to handle your projects as yeah. you know a renewable energy company. Yeah. I'd ask you, what are you looking for? What okay. is it that you want that talent to do for okay. you? So, I mean, when you start from asking yourself important questions like, what are you looking for? What, mm -hmm. what role are you trying to fill? You know, you begin to get a clearer definition, a clearer perspective of the, of the kind of talent that, you know, you need to hire, the kind of mm. talent that you need to get into your company. Okay. So, for instance, you want to get a solar installer. Mm -hmm. What are the qualities that a solar installer should have? What are the things that a solar installer should be able to do? What are the modern technologies that a solar installer should be able to, you know, understand? Get someone or put out applications to invite people to apply for such roles or work with yeah. companies such as ETC mm -hmm. that have this talent in our database ready to match with your company. Mm -hmm. And then look at the culture of the company. Try and see if the individual you're getting into your company can fit into that culture because a lot of people a lot of hiring companies you know suffer from hiring the wrong talents who do not fit into their company culture they have talents who are seemingly good on paper have good cvs have good credentials but by the time they get into the company they can't even last two months mm. because they do not have a cultural fit to that company mm. they do not know the things that they should know as a solar engineer but on on their cvs mm. they say they are solar engineers so one of the things that energy talent company does is that we vet these talents mm -hmm. You are a solar engineer, you are a solar installer, you are a customer service representative, yeah. you are a solar professional. Okay. We vet your skills, we put your skills to the test, and mm -hmm. then we can now match you to the different companies that require your services. Okay. So as a solar energy company looking to hire talent, you know, a lot of people are out of jobs. Okay. By the time you put out an application saying, or put out a hiring message saying, we're looking for two uh, solar installers. You find out that even people, people that read what now law can come and be applying for such jobs because there are no jobs and they need jobs. So by the time you, you know, work with companies like ETC that have these talents mm. and can supply you on demand. Another thing is time. Okay. You don't want well, to. How many talents do you have currently on your pipeline? Right. We have over 5,000 talents that have, you know, gone through different training programs with us okay and these talents have you know gone ahead to be matched with companies uh solar energy companies or even project-based companies that okay. do jobs in the renewable energy space and within our database over twenty thousand people have applied to our trainings okay yes so currently in our training cohorts in our talent co cohorts we have about 100 people right now mm -hmm. yes. so but what are the different um uh, programs or different Training. I know you have one on solar engineering. Yes. Uh, but what are the different courses or programs that people can come to train on at, at, at ETC? Okay. So at ETC, currently we have two uh, two parts. Really, we call them parts. Two parts that you can follow to get into the renewable energy space. Mm -hmm. So the first one is the solar engineering training, where we offer you trainings to become a world class. I like to put emphasis on world that. class a world class hmm. a world hmm. class solar hmm. engineer okay. so we offer you training to you know put yourself out there you can work in any country of your choice by okay. the time you are done with our training that's how hmm. good and special it is hmm. as a solar engineer and then we also offer the customer service part that's the non-technical like, part no, okay, non -technical. yes okay. so for someone who says oh i haven't i don't have a, a career or rather a background in stem mm. stem is like you know the sciences mm. so you can't get into the technical part you might struggle you can then opt for the customer service part which mm. is also a really great part mm. because a lot of companies they have these talents that are suitable for solar engineering mm. right but you know, they can't manage the relationships that they have with their customers because okay. they don't have good customer service well, it's just, just only customer service. What are the other non-technical yes, things? Yes, so offer? we're currently working on sales and business development that okay. will be out very soon. Mm. If right. I'm not doing anything on comms. <laughs> Abby, maybe we should do something on comms. So <laughs> it's going to see communications. It's going to work. Well, I, think, I think you'll be the one to chant. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. Derek, coming back to you now. Um, 
again, because you do curriculum design and everything, uh, what is the future of ETC in aligning with probably maybe the Nigerian um, University Commission? And um, your programs, what, 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 what is the future? Do you plan to merge with the university one day and do full-fledged degree programs? Okay. What is the future? Okay, thank you very much, Wisdom. So, uh, we, we appreciate the work universities are doing mm -hmm. in uh, their different uh, program areas. And uh, we believe those, those courses, those degrees, uh, they, are, they are unique in themselves. Yes, uh, in the near future, we plan to have some form of um, collaboration with universities where we collaborate on in certain areas but um, it's unlikely that we would run a full program okay. in the university or uh, the, similar to what universities are doing but uh, in the future we are we are still expanding not just within Nigeria we are we are expanding within Nigeria within other parts of Africa but our, our outlook really is global because the the, the solution we are we are seeking to provide is not it's not a localized one it's a mm. global one and the way the industry works is that um you have you have a lot of companies that uh, a lot of companies a lot of stakeholders that are not that are working multiple multiple regions so mm. uh what the solution we provide is something that has a global outlook the problem of solar energy mm. right now is not a nigerian problem okay it's a global problem and we are seeking to solve it with that sense uh, mm. from a global stand standpoint. So our future, our mm. outlook really is to expand globally, but we're starting from Nigeria and mm. other parts of Africa. Mm. What, what is the cost of your programs? I mean, uh, somebody listening now is interested, ready to go, but how much is it? How affordable is it? Okay. Um, well, what I would say, the, the major cost that you really need to pay, mm. and I really need to listen to me, the major cost you need to have is interest and attention hmm. yes interest and attention uh, we are not we are not looking for time wasters people who would say they just want to come and see what's happening okay. we're looking for people who are genuinely interested in building a career in the solar energy industry okay. and if you're not sure if this is for you yes you can reach out to us and we can have a conversation to to let you to find out if this is for you in the course of the program we, we are not going to charge you any money because uh, we're we are interested in developing the industry. We're interested in developing, providing talent, as our name suggests, energy talent. So That's, you're saying, I don't need money. I just need interest. Interest. Okay. So by the time you come in mm. and we place you through the program mm. and then by the time you now get a job, okay. we help you with our placement services. It's from there, we would now deduct money from... Um, what you're earning over a period but of time. come, let's train you first. Let's train you first. Okay. So our focus is on the training, training. first, on mm. helping you become a functional and productive member of the industry. All right. If you're just tuning in, my name is Wisdom Chap Jumbo, and this is Power Solutions. Power Solutions is powered by Olon Energy Impact Investment Company, with support from Nigeria Info, your number one talk station. And we have been discussing the future of work in renewable energy. And my guest here, Oluwa Daria Kingwale, Senior Curriculum and Programs Associate, and um, Inkechi Unwa Konobi, Communications Associate from Energy Talent Company, have been helping me to make sense on, on what the future of work is in this sector. Uh, now, time is fast spent. You're rounding up. But tell us about some of your partners, uh, Dari. Uh, do you have partners you work with? I know Alon is one of your partners. One shekare for us. <laughs> Alan is one of your partners, but tell us, I mean, you should have other partners you work with. Yes, uh, we, we have uh, some other company partners that we work with. I'll just mention, uh, there's ICE, um, it's a solar energy company as okay. well. We've, um, we've, we've sent a number of our apprentices to them, okay. and they've, um, they've worked with them, and they have good testimonials. Uh, we have also Husk, Husk, um, Husk Power. Husk Power, yes. Mm. We've, we've done that with them, and we are initiating new relationships every day so um i'm sure uh, you know the beautiful thing of all these partners you're already working with most of them are also investors of all on i, I mean much like for us <laughs> 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 all right anyways so we're running up Ikechi. Right. Um, any success story from the work etc is doing you want to share briefly in one minute okay so i like to put it like this etc mm. is helping young people create a better life 
So we've had people come on our programs, our training programs, people who didn't have jobs, they're out mm-hmm. of school, stranded, you know, no work. We've had them come on our programs and get equipped to be able to you know create value in the various companies that they've been placed in mm. and they're earning good money they're mm. earning good money now because of the training that they have gotten from us so there are so many stories really so many what is the duration so of your stories. training what's the duration okay our training program lasts for a couple of months okay and um a couple of months a couple How of many? months uh-huh. um let me, let, me, let me just give a, a brief breakdown of that. So mm. if you're coming in freshly mm. as a new, as a young graduate, you're starting our training, yes, in the first few months, you would go through our Genesis specialization and apprenticeship. So okay. the Genesis program is for three weeks. It's the first introductory training okay. where we talk. Then after you. that, how, how long? After, after that, then there's a specialization where you now go into the technical aspect. So if you're going for the technical line or that you're takes, going for the non-technical you focus on that that takes how long that takes a month, a month. then okay. afterwards there's a six weeks of apprenticeship where you mm. attach with the company okay. and you get to work for six weeks okay after, afterwards then is the placement beautiful yeah. beautiful. beautiful all right so now people listening to you want to contact you so how how can they reach etc at the moment in Kichi, please quickly help us with that okay so you can send us an email uh send an email to placement at energy talent company.com energy talent co.com actually or you can follow us on instagram at energy underscore talent co uh on twitter at energy talent co or you can just contact if you're a company trying to get talent you can call or whatsapp this number 090-3609-3145 or if you are looking to call the number to, again please okay for companies looking to get talent 090-360-93145 all right that's a good place to um, round up the show for today uh, i mean enough information today on jobs and the future of work and what's happening in this sector and uh, you can catch a replay on this after now but it is important don't sit idle anymore it's time to get a job for yourself it's time to get into the renewable energy sector there was no time to tell you all the different jobs available for you uh, but solar installation is one you can start from there but until next week again my name is wisdom this is power solutions it's been nice talking to you all i will meet you again next week god bless <laughs>